So you guys asked for a room tour and so I'm going to give you a little overview and I'm going to give you a workspace tour. Um, this is my workspace as you can see. It's um, I've got all my artwork up here um, and it's in my bedroom, yes. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and give you a little tour of my workspace and where I do all of my videos and artwork. So um, up there on the wall I have a poster up. I love it and um, we should get started with the main workspace area I think um, okay so down here I have like just easy things I can access at any moment like things I need all the time so I use playing cards a lot so that's why that's up there um, my main use brushes and other art utensils down here I've got my paint jar for the paint water um, in here I've got a lot of just little knickknacks germ mixes and stuff. Um, down here I have my, um, this was my old Bible and this is the one I currently use, my planner which I need for everything. Sticky notes, as you can tell I need my sticky notes and then in here are some boxes with some um, jewelry and some pins. So up here I've got my Wandla series and some other comics and stuff. Um, I've got the Zelda comic, more larger paintbrushes that I don't use a whole lot, but I want to try getting into using more. Um, calligraphy book. Up here I've got my old Nancy Drew series, a photo album, um, just some makeup brushes. This rock is just a little thing from Florida. Excuse my messy hands I was painting. Um, up here more jewelry. Then up to this second part is this right here is where I like ha keep all my hair and makeup stuff up here. Um, just some books for decoration, my mirror, just some more decorations. Up here I've got like play, more paintings and some art supplies. It's a card. So uh, yep, that's pretty much my desk area. Now to move down here, we've got um, we've got three little drawers down here and some canvases over here. I'll start with the canvases. Um, over here, I've got some mugs. This is for an upcoming video. Um, these paintings are either finished or part of the way finished, like that one. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that back in there. Some blank canvases for me to grab. Up here I've got paint brushes and all of my different watercolor palettes. In here is a bunch of just random art supplies I don't really use much. Um, I've got Mod Podge jewelry case. I don't use this drawer so I'm gonna move down to this one. This one's got um, a bunch of headbands and hair supplies. These are my watercolor um, pencils. This is my tablet down here. This is a random box of knickknacks and keepsakes. This is my gouache supply. Um, this, these are all the different gouaches I use. So I'm going to put that back in there. Down there is more watercolors. So I'll put those in. The last drawer down here is this has my spray on Mod Podge. This stuff is super handy for when you're finishing paintings and stuff. And then I've got my big case with some magic trick stuff I've had forever. Some old notebooks and sketchbooks and stuff down there. Um, mini file and my binoculars. Okay. Now beneath my desk I have a trash can for just easy stuff. Then this is my main pencil case I use all the time. Um, this is the one I bring with me just about I'm trying to do this with one hand and it doesn't want to work. This is the one I bring with me everywhere. It's got all my most used, this shouldn't be in there, but it's got all my most used art supplies. Um, just a whole lot of good stuff in there. I recommend these Tombow brush markers. They're amazing for multiple things. Down here I've got Clorox wipes, um, two boxes of just index cards and other random things in here. This has a bunch of like crafting supplies like beads and thread and stuff. 
And down here, I used to sell little friendship bracelets like a long time ago, but that's where I keep all my stuff to make them. And I have a bunch in there. So. And then this is just for another upcoming video, the Sharpies. So that's what that is. So there's a little overview of my entire desk area. I'm going to push this chair back in. And then over here, we've got um, little, I don't know what you would call this, like a poster, but it's like a collage. That's what it is. And then down here, I've got a mirror um, in here. Mirror was sitting here. I've got all my Oohu markers, um, coloring page. And then this is my sketchbook I can grab easily. This is what I'm currently working on. I can just set that on my desk. Down here I've got a horse book. It has lots of good pictures for when I'm drawing. Um, pop painting by I cannot pronounce her name. But yeah, there's her last name. Smash book, an art book, um, origami book. This is my comic I'm working on. That's what that is. And then this is probably my favorite area because it is all my different, like, art from, like, a span of years. So, I mean, I have other art stored somewhere. Like, this one I just did. And then I have, like, spare paper. I've got a lot of, like, um, just artwork from other videos. Just lots of cool stuff in here. Um, artwork that no one's seen before so that's what's in this file then down here we've got a few more folders with old and another empty file to fill um, I've got my watercolor paper I use mainly this Canson one is really good and then I've got these are super old sketchbooks from like elementary and then these are the sketchbook series that have probably been on my channel so like some of my older sketchbook tours lots of cool stuff in here I'll show you one of my most more recent ones I like that page that one's really cool lots of cool stuff in there so that is for my little shelf area so um, yeah this is my workspace and then over here um, this is my dresser I've got some more decorations and just stuff and then my paint palette and then I store all of my extra artwork down at the bottom here under so like any loose paper that's like <laughs> oh my goodness this is like super old um, I haven't looked at this in a while but just a lot of old artwork under here and then um, I think that wraps up my entire workspace so, I, guess, I hope you guys enjoy this. If you want to see a tour of my entire room, then go ahead and comment that below. But I sold this one. So, I'm going to have to say goodbye, but I really like it. So, moving on from my file, I'm going to set this over here. I've got a bunch of other folders that are ready to be filled with artwork. Down here, I've got my watercolor paper. I use Canson mainly, and then I don't know what brand the other one is. Down here I've got a bunch of elementary sketchbooks and junior high sketchbooks and then right here are more recent so this is one of my mo more recent ones not a whole lot but oh yeah it's it's decently recent this one I actually have a sketchbook tour out so if you guys want to see this I'll put the link up in the corner where the info card is and you guys can click on that and watch this sketchbook tour so, yep, go check that out. Um, I actually have a video on some of those paintings too. So, yep. So that covers my entire desk area. I'm going to put this file and book back in a second. But that is my entire desk area. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, go ahead and like, subscribe, hit the notification button so you can see the rest of my videos. I do a lot of art videos and vlogs. So until next time, this is Shay J. Goodbye.